Ushahidi unaendelea kukusanywa kuhusiana na mauaji ya Miri Wamboi. Hii leo polisi wamepata gari la marehemu lenye nambari za usajili KCC 068U linaloshukiwa kubeba mwili wake kutoka mtawa Fowes mpaka Juja. Gari limepatikana katika soko la Ngewa na limesemekana kuwa hapo kwa siku mbili bila kushughulikiwa na mtu yeyote. It stayed there for over 24 hours. Then it was later towed to Ngewa police post where we are now. Uhusiano wa washukiwa wa mauaji ya Meri unaweza kuelezwa kupitia umbali wa anakuishi mshuki wa Judy Wangoi na alikoishi Joseph Kori pamoja na mkewe Meri na familia yake. Katika mitandao ya kijamii wa Kenya wamegadhabishwa na mauaji hayo lakini majirani wangali wameduazwa na kilichojiri. We've not had any issue with her. She's had a good stay here. Um, she's little known to, to, to the people around. I guess she was um, she hasn't stayed here for long also. Nyumba ya kifahari alioishi Judy huenda ni kielelezo cha umuhimu wake kwa mpenzi wake ambaye inadaiwa aligaramia kodi yake kila mwezi. Kulingana na wasimamizi wa mtaa huu, hakuna mayowe yaliyosikika katika siku iliyoripotiwa kuwa Mary Wamboi aliuawa. There's no alarm that has been raised. Uh, we've not had any neighbors say oh we've had noises from this particular house. Can you come and check what is happening? Or the Guard who is allocated to that particular court never uh, noticed anything funny. NTV lifika katika nyumba hiyo katika mtaa huu wa kifahari. Usiku huo inasemekana kuwa Mary Wamboi alifika hapa akapanda mpaka gorofa ya pili asijue kuwa mauti yake angemfika katika nyumba hii. It was well planned according to us because there's no noise at all at all eneo hili ndilo mwili wa Mary Wamboi ulipatikana baadaye mume wake alipata kukamatwa katika eneo hili na maafisa ambao walikuwa naendeleza uchunguzi uchunguzi bado unaendelea kubaini kama alichangia katika mauaji ya mkewe Chaiti Mwangi NTV